new formation this year, so that's been pretty different for us. We had one forward before and now we have three, so a lot more offensive. And we got 10 new girls, so it was a lot of different, like having a half of a new team, but we've done really well and we worked really well together from day one, so it hasn't been a problem. We still play with four defenders, so it's been the same, just tackle hard and win the ball. <laughs> Everyone gets along really well. We haven't had any problems with that. And we lost a lot of players from last year that did a lot for our team, but a lot of girls have stepped up and done really well. And we had a lot of returners and all the new players have done awesome so far. I was interested in a couple different schools and I came to visit here and I really liked the campus and Lewis was really good at recruiting and he just told us kind of what it was all about and I really liked it. And I knew a couple girls that were already here and they told me they, how much they loved it. So it was an easy decision. I'm in health studies for pre-PT. Um, I really like my major. Um, I decided on it my freshman year and I've really enjoyed taking it here with all the different teachers and the classes have been really fun. So. I think I've gotten more aggressive just over the, over the years and um, been working really hard on like my passing and finding like the best pass all the time. So that's basically what I've been working on personally. <laughs> Defensively, we've pretty much done the same thing, winning the ball and then trying to play in a two-touch rhythm in the back and just passing it around the back to have a good foundation to go forward. I started when I was about five. I'm pretty sure my parents just put me on a team with my friends. And I played a couple other sports and then in high school, I just focused on soccer. And basically that was my focus all through high school until college and throughout college. <laughs> I'm not superstitious at all. I just. I'm pretty quiet before games. I just kind of like to focus and I'm not too social. I don't know if that's a superstition, but um, the team's pretty superstitious though. When we travel, we always are on the bus in the same exact seats and a lot of people do the same things before games. Started the wobble tradition this year and we do it before home games and basically just a group of people get up and we do the wobble before Lewis can, comes in and give us our pregame talk and it's been fun. <laughs> a lot of people are really superstitious about that now. Well, obviously our ultimate goal would be a national championship, but we've tried to take it just a week at a time. Every week our goal is to win two games and put ourselves in the best position we can for postseason. And this week is the last week of conference play, so our goal this week is just to win both games, win the league, and prepare ourselves for the conference tournament next week. I like to get shutouts, so that's always a personal goal for me and a challenge. Um, our defense has done really well with that this year, and I think we're going to keep getting more shutouts, too. Parents, a lot. I call them all the time, and they've motivated me through everything and been so supportive, so they're the people I go to when I need support. It's too many memories to just pick one for my favorite, but um, basically, like, I've made so many great friends, and all these girls that have been on my team, they're like my family. And really that's probably been my favorite part is just getting to know all these girls and making such good friends.